got at the minute is a, an attempt at coup by the establishment, and by capitalism, and, and the flunkies inside and outside of the Labour Party. I think uh, they're, they're absolutely terrified, because for the first time in probably 30 years, they've got somebody who would seriously undermine their privileges, and if he's elected, uh, will instigate a massive redistribution of power and wealth in this country. I think everybody was ecstatic after we heard about Corbyn's victory and the scale of Corbyn's victory, even despite the fact that they were trying to weed out thousands of people uh, from the voting process. I think that uh, what we can't do is just rely on you know, Jeremy Corbyn getting elected. The fight now is going to be over the anti-trade union bill that's just been passed. The austerity cuts, so we've got to respond to that industrially and through on the streets through protests and demonstrations. But we also have to get uh, Jeremy Corbyn elected. I mean, that's the, in my mind, that's the two things aren't uh, aren't contradictory. We've got to do both of them together. I think that we finally got somebody with uh, the possibility of getting into power who will be fighting an anti austerity agenda, who will be backing trade unionists and working class people. When the previous anti union legislation came in, there was a lot of talk. We were going to do this, we were going to do that. Nothing actually transpired. We had a couple of marches up and down Hyde Park, and that was against austerity as well, same script. And we've got to go further than that now. If the TUC can't coordinate national action, in my opinion, what we have to do is get all those unions that can coordinate action together and, uh, you know, if possible, have, have, a, have, a, have a national strike. If it's not possible to have a national strike, then we have a, as many unions on the same day coordinating their action. My own personal opinion is, is that if, if Jeremy Corbyn survives these, these attempted coups against him, I think it's, uh, I, I, would, I would encourage everybody on a personal basis to join the Labour Party and get down there and support him.